Good morning and welcome to the Great Journey Podcast. I'm here with 8th Jury Black Belt, Sensei Marty Callahan. And today we are talking about one of the katas that our students perform in our school. And a kata is a series of movements. Uh-huh. Yes. Against imaginary opponents. Yeah. Against imaginary opponents. Yep. And today we are talking about one in particular called Basai Dai. So could you mm-hmm. please explain to us yes. um, the meaning of Basai Dai? Yes. And it's a bit of a twofold meaning. Um, uh, the primary meaning is that of breaking down a fortress. Okay. And um, a fortress is essentially an institution mm-hmm. of some kind or a, an established entity mm-hmm. that's very, very strong. Mm-hmm. And so it's having the belief that you can take down something that's very powerful, that's Mm -hmm. very much Mm well-established. And that becomes necessary in life because um, institutions can become, uh, you know, they're... They can be. They can really not really function correctly anymore. Right. And so they end up hurting people instead of helping people. Right. Um, and institutions can stay ar- along around a lot longer than their usefulness is. Mm-hmm. And you just have to take it down. Yeah. Uh, you have to. Sometimes you have to destroy things. Right. And in order to make something better. Yeah. Absolutely. And so it has that meaning, but along with that comes the meaning of being able to change a disadvantageous situation into an advantageous situation. Right. And and that goes right along with destroying this institution. Mm -hmm. The institution is not working in people's favor. It's Mm -hmm. working against people. Mm -hmm. So it's a a disadvantage to have this institution. Yeah. And to turn it around, destroy it, and turn it into something useful. Right. That's a very powerful thing. Okay. Um, And I I think we see it going on in our country right now. Yeah. To, through the Black Lives Matters, mm-hmm. for example, yeah. movement, yeah. Uh, where there's been um, social institutions mm-hmm. that really um, uh, hold uh, racism mm-hmm. in into it, that are built into the structure of it, mm-hmm. and those social institutions, the social norms, they have to be broken down, mm-hmm. and. Um, it's not enough just to ask people politely to take them down right? because these people that are invested in them, yeah. they are, they're, they're getting something from it. Right. They have a little bit of elitist yeah. stuff going on. Yeah. yeah. And so um, you have to <clears throat> do it for, through protests and, mm-hmm. and uh, you have to, you know, actively work at, destroying or breaking down that right now i'm, I'm not talking about violence right. but it's it's a rebellion really is what it is mm-hmm. and there are times but you, you can rebel peacefully mm-hmm. and get your same point across like martin luther king yeah, yeah. martin luther king right yes mm-hmm. no absolutely i was going to say something on that topic but i think you just lost me with martin luther king okay <laughs> but um yes oh i was going to say yes so we just finished a previous podcast talking about the perfection of character. Yep. If we're seeking the perfection of character, yes, and that is something that we all have in yep. common, right? Yep. Regardless of where we're from, what we do, all that. Our character is something that we all have in common. We all bleed the same. Yep. Yep. Um, is uh, those institutions, if they're also seeking perfection of character, yes. and then people, if all people are, are seeking that, yes. then we may not have as much trouble as we have today. Yeah. I think that's kind of where I was going with that. Yeah, I, I, I think that's true. You yeah. know, if uh, if everyone in the world valued human yes. character and human yeah. development, yeah. then we would all be working towards developing all human beings yeah. into the best uh, person that they could be. Right. Um, um, and there are a lot of people that are doing that. Yeah. Although they're doing it by trying to make people's lives better. Mm -hmm. And um, that is important, but that's not quite the same thing as the development of character. It's a little bit of a band-aid and not so much a solution to the true root of the issue. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Good. I guess that we're on a moot point right now. (laughs) It's true. We all, I, yeah. 
life is kind of crazy right now, but that's why this school's so great because we're teaching kids of many colors and many races, yes. the common goal of seeking perfection of character yep. and leadership, caring for each other, our community and beyond. And, and in this case, the principle of breaking down fortresses and yes. changing disadvantage into advantage. Right, we gotta be optimistic and look for the good. Yep. Yes, all right. Well, that's a, a little bit meatier than I expected it to be today, but thank you so much for your time and thank you for listening and we will see you next time on the Great Journey Podcast. Have a great day. Okay, bye-bye.